What is the difference between a dill pickle and a cucumber? Why are dill pickles called pickles? Let's unravel the pickle of a pickle. First, the starting line. A dill pickle begins its humble life as a cucumber. Cucumbers are the unassuming fresh produce, the rookies in the world of pickles. Crunchy green and often found tossed into salads, they're hydrating and packed with certain nutrients, complementing our sandwiches and gin tonics. Now give that cucumber a bath of transformation. The process involves a soak in a brine, which is a mix of vinegar, water, and a dance party of spices, dill being the guest of honor. In this briny hot tub, cucumbers chill out for quite some time. Could be days, could be weeks. They're not in a rush. They're pickling. During this soak, the cucumber's crisp innocence takes on the complex flavors and characters of the spices, transforming into a dill pickle, a tart, sometimes garlicky persona, that's as welcome at a BBQ as a cold beer on a hot Portland day. Why the term pickle? In the culinary context, to pickle something is essentially to preserve it in a solution usually containing vinegar, salt, and often a bouquet of herbs and spices. Pickling as a method can be applied to all sorts of fruits and veggies. But in many places, the cucumber won this lottery of names. When we say pickle, it's the cucumber that gets to wear the crown. Maybe it's the alliteration of dill and pickle that amused our ancestors, or maybe cucumbers were just overachievers in the pickling pageant. So when someone says they're in a pickle, remember, it's a space where the common cucumber elevates itself into something extraordinary, a rite of passage from fresh to zest, and that's the dill.